Hi guys, so this is the last video in data representation. There may be more to recap later on, but at the moment I've just given you the basics of what you need to know and things that will help you with your revision. So uh, the last thing I really need to talk to you, which I could have talked about earlier on, is the impact of binary shift. Now binary shift is where we move the numbers either left or right. Okay, so that might look different on your screen. But anyway, moving forward. So say for example, you have a binary number here. So we've got one, 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 zero, one, zero, 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 okay? Uh, now, please ignore the place value of this, okay? This was just to demonstrate what is happening. Now, if I am shifting to the left, I want you to think about the impact that happens, the impact on that number. Is it gonna go, is it going to double or is it going to actually half? Well, this is what this presentation is, and it's going to be a quick one, is going to aim to show you. Now, say for example, the value below is 10 in binary, okay? Now, if I shift this to the left, notice what's happened. By doing one shift, I've multiplied that by two. So the number has essentially doubled. Now, if I have to move that left another time, that number will double, so it becomes 40. So I want you to think about the power that is moving that left, all right? So notice, if I move numbers left, if I, move, if I have a binary shift to the left, essentially, each time I've moved it, I've doubled it. So notice the pattern. As it increases to the left, it doubles. Now, the problem comes when we need to move it to the right, because obviously each time, so for each shift to the right, we are going to then divide it by two instead of multiplying it, all right? So this little tip here helps you with the, the multiplying, okay? Multiplying it by four if it's two places, three places by eight and four places and so on. But like I said, if we start moving it to the right, we have an issue because eventually the numbers disappear and we use our we lose our accuracy so have a look at this so as i shift to the right i actually start losing all right so i can divide by two each time it moves to the right but eventually i'm going to lose accuracy so you need to be able to be aware of that and it's a really really quick tip if i'm moving to the left each shift to the left i double if I move to the right, I half, but eventually you will lose accuracy and that's what you need to be aware of. And it's a sh simple, short, quick video. Uh, if you've had worksheets in my lessons, you will be able to continue going over this as a quick recap. But what you really need to be aware of is one shift to the right is a divide by two. One shift to the left is a, div is a multiply by two. So left, you multiply by two, right you divide by two if you have two shifts then it would be four or three shifts would be eight and so on and notice the pattern that's going there so i hope that's been useful to you uh simple binary shift lesson thank you